you've seen him do. Who are you? Remember me. It's me, it's you, it's Dean, it's Jesse, Chris. It's no one more faults than it's Dean. We gotta stop this. Cop, don't fall asleep. Hey, what you watching? Gut Ripper. We're running out of the force. The 70 hour mark, the insomniac will be a new experience of micro naps. It means you're dreaming, but you don't know it. Man, you really shouldn't be watching this, you know. Who are you to judge? You really shouldn't be eating this, Zach. Who are you to judge? Hey, come on, Zach. You shouldn't be smoking that. Who are you to judge? You really want to know? If I'll shut you up. So, where do you think rules came from in the first place? Well, everybody knows that a bunch of old guys got together and they made a bunch of decisions and laws and they decided what was right and what was wrong and they called it the social contract. Welcome one and all to the first meeting on deciding the social contract of what is right and what is wrong. First case, line, yay or nay? Nay. Murder. Nay. Rape. Nay. Mowage. Yay. <laughs> Stealing. Nay. Yay. Nay. Yay. Nay. The social contract theory can't be right because everybody automatically knows that there certain things are right, like helping an old lady cross the street, and the other things are morally wrong, like going to Mars and getting raped by Martians. Well then, what about the instinct theory that says our morals evolved with us over time? If morals evolved with us over time, then our instinct would be to do what's right. If that's so, then why do we struggle with the right thing? Hey, buddy. Man, that music's pretty bad. You shouldn't be listening to that. That may be true for you, but it's not true for me. Well, that can't be absolutely true. Yes, it can. No, it can't. Let me give you an example. Don't you ever forget I'm on a boat and it's going fast and I got an article theme has been what are you doing? I'm riding my unicorn to Michigan. What does that look like? I'm jacking up stereo. You can't do that! It may be true for you, but not true for me. Okay, so if I stole your stereo, it'd be wrong, right? Right. Go. But in your line of reasoning, I could do whatever I wanted because what's right for you isn't necessarily right for me. You see, you can't truly live as a relativist because if someone does something you don't like and you voice that opinion, you go against relativism. Well, there is no truth. By saying that, you're stating that there is truth. You just said there is no truth. Well, that's a declaration, which, by definition, is making something evident, which is truth. So, to answer your question, judging is not wrong. Judging hypocritically or with harmful intent is wrong. Judging with the intent of encouraging someone to do what's right is, in fact, healthy. The end. My muscles! Oh, crap! <laughs> The light is small, so it's black on the tip. May be true for you, but not for me. You didn't let me finish my line. <laughs> Hold up. Mike. Now that I finally have a.